Hello, Marty Thomas here with Energy Improvements. Uh, maybe you're aware of the Occupy Wall Street that's going on in Athens tomorrow, 11-11-11, November 11, 2011. Uh, Occupy Wall Street is the resistance continues at Liberty Square and Worldwide. Uh, it's the rally for the 99%. Uh, whatever your views on that are, we don't know. But we were thinking about that here, and we recent discovery we made, we're doing lots of research here, trying to stay on top of energy trends and things like that. And we noticed that the Department of Energy found that 90% of homes, that's 90% of homes in America, do not have proper ventilation. You may have radiant barrier. You may have R60 value on your insulation. You may have new windows. But if you do not have proper ventilation, if the airflow is not simply moving through your attic, all of these means, of course, are great, but they're going to be minimal. So to optimize your uh, energy savings, you want to have proper ventilation. Some people say, well, I've got a whirly bird, or I've got a dormer, or I have ridge vents. And all these are, are good. They're not bad, but they're really passive forms of ventilation. Uh, one of the products that we have here is our uh, solar-powered ventilator. Many people do electric uh, ventilators. Those are good. Electric ventilators are good. However, they're using electricity. This is one of our 20-watt uh, embedded solar panels. You may can see there that it's actually embedded into the unit. One single unit, no cords, no cables. Uh, this goes in your home. It's as powerful as 10 whirlybirds, 10 wind turbines. And the motor's a German-built motor guaranteed for 50,000 hours of life. This is a great product. And it ventilates your attic up to 1,250 square feet. Um, this is very important. Uh, many people years ago, if they didn't have anything in the old days, they had good ventilation in their attic. And for some reason, through modern house building, we got away from that. Now we're coming back. Proper ventilation is important. So again, 90% of, of people in America, homeowners in America, do not have proper ventilation. That means only 10% are properly ventilating their home. And without a properly ventilated attic, it's going to get too hot up there. The photos are going to melt. The things that you preserve in your attic are going to melt. Uh, there's cause for fire. Also, not to mention the mold and mildew. That's something that people don't consider. Your attic gets moldy, mildewy. And the proper ventilation is moving all of that heat out of your attic. Very important. So the question is, are you going to be a 90 percenter or are you going to be a 10 percenter? They're going to occupy Wall Street. Whatever your views are on that, but one thing we do know we all agree on, we want to save money, we want to save energy, we want to live better. And so, you know, let's be one of those 10 percenters. Let's be people that save money. Let's, let's consider ventilating your attic.